All right, what do you want to do this weekend? Well, the countdown to Fat Tuesday is on, and you can't just have one punch key on you Fat can't? Tuesday. It's hard, so you they might as well good. get to work today. All right, so <laughs> the whole idea of this is to not really feel guilty about eating a punch key on Fat Tuesday. Those deep fried jelly filled Oof. donuts. Hamtramck is hosting the fifth annual punch key run. That's where our Priya man is live for us this morning. Good morning to you, Priya. Good morning, Sean and Lauren. It's a chilly start, but things are going to be heating up real quick. The fourth annual Poonch Key Run kicks off at 10 this morning. I'm joined by jo Joan Bittner. And jo Joan, let's just start with your shirt. Uh. <laughs> Pretty clear, oh, she loves him, Tramic. Yeah. A lot of history here with the Poonch Key Run. Talk to me about that. We, we've had the countdown for 11 years, and we're so excited that it drew the attention of the Punchki runners, there's going to be over 2,000 in the city today, and it's going to be very exciting. What do you think it means for uh, the city of Hamtramck and the 2,500 runners who will be here today? I'm excited because I think we're going to attract people who have never been here before. They need to come here and find out what a great, fun city this is. And we've got some uh, beautiful pieces out here. Can you talk to me about that? Well, we import things from Poland at our store, Polish Art Center, and these are some of the newest items we got in. We're really big in the Polish stoneware, or sometimes people refer to it as pottery. And we have, well, we have a store full. And we have our famous shirt with the punchki. Seven basic food groups, of course. Punchki is there. <laughs> <laughs> I got to ask, which is your favorite flavor? Oh, I like custard, sorry. <laughs> My husband, prune, <laughs> is a traditional. Prune? Yes. That's, wow. that's the traditional prune and rose petal jam is the, is the most uh, well, you're living dangerously, Joan. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining us to today. The Poonchki Run kicks off at 10 this morning. Uh, you can register here on site, $45, or you can do it online for $40. Uh, $45 here, $40 online. Uh, it kicks off at 10. There's going to be a lot of excitement here. And coming up, we will be doing some taste testing. I'll let you know which is my favorite flavor. Reporting live from him, driving. I'll send it back to you. We're doing the same thing right back here, talking about our favorite flavors, Priya. Do they tempt the runners, like, with punchkis on a string at the finish line, like, Someone coming? Someone said you know? and beer at the end, so it's a calorie-packed morning. Up. That's a good idea. <laughs> Priya, thanks oh, so gosh. much. We'll check in with you in just a little bit. Well, people all across Metro Detroit are lacing up their sneakers and getting ready for a race to maybe run off those Fat Tuesday calories. They're just, they're thinking ahead. I think it's a great <laughs> idea. It's the fourth annual Punchki Run in Hamtramck. Priya Man is there live. Hi, Priya. Good morning, Sean and Lauren. 2,500 runners expected today at the fourth annual Punchki Run. I'm joined by Victoria Katansky. You're with Tour Detroit. And Victoria, talk to me about the route. This was very strategically planned throughout the city of Hamtramck. Yeah, so we, um, the route actually, I ran probably 20, um, different routes coming up with the one that we settled on and it's the same one that we settled on four years ago. Um, the reason we like it so much is that it goes past a lot of historic landmarks like St. Florian Church, um, and my grandfather's old store site. Um, we also go through um, some of the more well-known restaurants and bakeries like Polonia and Polish Village Cafe. Um, and then it just, it really shows like the residential side of the community and how really dense Hamtramck is. Can you talk to me about where it starts and finishes for folks who are thinking, hey, this is a good day to do a 5K run? So we start right in the middle of Joseph Campo, just south of Holbrook. And basically we take over um, Joseph Campo for a few hours and um, that's where you can find the registration and information. And the treats are really at the end of the run. Absolutely. <laughs> so it takes about 15 minutes, imagine that, for the fastest runner to cross the finish line. So as soon as our runners leave, we have a group of volunteers that have to pull all of those, it's like 210 dozen punchki, out into the middle of Joseph wow. Campo. And um, then we also have beer ready for them from Axel. That sounds perfect. You can't ask for more on a Saturday. And again, you can register here on site for $45, or you can register online for $40. Uh, the race Race kicks off at 10 a.m. Hope to see you out here reporting live from him. Tremic, I'm Priya Man. Back to you. Well, we've been talking about punchki flavors all morning. Someone just told me a cannoli cream filled. They do have that punchki. Yes. I need to try that one. Which has to be from a ham tramic <laughs> bakery. Baking all night. Monday, Tuesday mm. morning. It's going to be amazing. All right, happening today. It's the fourth annual. Punchki run taking place in the heart of Punchki Town, Hamtramck. I was out there last year. This is big, folks. Runners are getting ready to lace up their shoes and eat some Punchkis. Priya Man live this morning, and Priya, this has become a really, really neat annual uh, celebration for Hamtramck.
Absolutely. More than 2,500 runners expected. The race kicks off at 10 a.m., but really everyone's talking about the Poonchkis. You can get some great, delicious donuts, get some beer after you've, you know, burned off some calories. You can just eat up again. I'm joined by the mayor of Hamtramck, Mayor Majewski. And, uh, you know, Mayor, what does this run mean for the city of Hamtramck? Well, this is such a great event for Hamtramck, bringing in all these people, some of whom uh, may never have been to Hamtramck before. They'll get to walk our streets or run our streets, um, and they'll see that uh, Hamtramck is, uh, is a walkable community. It's a close-knit community, and we hope they'll come back. And there's a lot of money raised from this run as well. Can you talk to me about that? Yeah, sure. The money um, that this run raises goes for non-motorized transport initiatives, and that's really important for the metro Detroit area in general, but especially for Hamtramck, which is already um, so closely connected to some other initiatives, the Dequinder Cut and, and, and um, other opportunities for non-motorized in, uh, in the metro area. And as I said before, we're a city already that you can walk. You can walk anywhere. To, we're two square miles. You can walk to the bakery um, any day of the week and, and get your punchki. Um, you can uh, you know walk to the bank, do your do your normal business on foot and on bicycle, and that's really important to us, and it's part of the fabric of our community. You know, Sean was mentioning this is really a celebration. Uh, you know, how much do you look forward to this run year after year? Oh, you know, <laughs> punchki day is is uh, is one of our national holidays in Hamtramck. So, um, <laughs> yeah, so, and it's kind of a marathon for us since now you know we start even. Here with the run Absolutely. on Saturday morning, the very first uh, event uh, that and events continue all, all right. the way through uh, through late um, Tuesday night. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much, You're Mayor. Welcome. And again, the race starts at 10 a.m. You can register right here. It's $45, and then of course you can have some delicious donuts and some beer after you've burned off those calories. Reporting live from Hamtramck, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. That's my kind of run. Right? <laughs> know, right? My only kind or of run right now. you just skip the run and just see. <laughs> exactly. This is a celebration, right? It's about partying. <laughs> well, they said there's punchkas and beer afterwards. Priya, thanks so much. And all morning long, we've been connecting with you on Facebook and on Twitter. What's your favorite punchki flavor? You beat me to it, Lauren. You said raspberry. That is my number one as well. Lemon is also really good, but we're mm -hmm. getting ready for Fat Tuesday when the lines are going to be out the door. Are we going to have snow or cold temps on Tuesday? Well, on Tuesday itself, yeah, we will have some snow showers, but, you know, not enough to shut anything down, especially on a, on a day like Fat Tuesday. Right? right in time now, 734. We are a few days away from Fat Tuesday. The countdown is on, also known as Punchki Day. Look at them. They, aren't they beautiful? <laughs> as we begin to binge on Punchkis, there's an event letting you preempt a little bit of shame and guilt that might come with woofing down one of the Poonchkis. Priya Man live at the Poonchki run in Hamtramck this morning. Oh, gorgeous morning there, Priya. Hi. Good morning. Absolutely. It's a gorgeous day, a gorgeous day for a 5K run. And of course, as you mentioned, there's a lot of punch keys and beer to be had. I'm joined by Tom, Carolyn, and David. This is their first year running in the fourth annual punch key run. Why'd you decide to participate? Well, we, we love running. Uh, we're, we've been aspiring runners for a lot of years. We love spending time together, and we love everything Polish. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. i got to ask, what's your favorite flavor? It's got to be prune. If you're Polish, it's got to be prune. <laughs> That's a really interesting mix, I thought, between the taste of a prune and then, you know, a very sweet donut. Yes, it is. It's you only get it once a year usually, and that's punchy, <laughs> unless you have two or three or four that same day. <laughs> so how many are you planning on having today? One. <laughs> <laughs> so you are first year participating. Uh, what are you anticipating? Uh, I'm a little nervous. I haven't <laughs> ran in a while. Really? Yeah, and I'll just give it my all. Absolutely. And what else could you do, right? Yeah. So, you know, there's a lot of fun to be had today. What do you think this run means for the city of Hamtramck? Well, we've been coming down here, for, you know, since I was a little kid, and it's fun to come back to the streets and and visit the restaurants and visit the, uh, the bakeries that have been part of our lives for so many years. Um, but you know what? We got to remember that while this is a fun day and we have a lot of fun, have a couple punch keys, have a beer. This is really this going to be the start of Lent, so we got to reflect on that as well. Absolutely, and that's a perfect way to end off. Well, thank you guys so much. You guys are going to be fantastic. You have nothing to be worried about. <laughs> <laughs> and the race kicks off at 10 this morning. You can register here uh, for $45, and the money raised will actually benefit the city of Hamtramck. Um, so there's a lot of good stuff happening today, and of course, you can get your fill of punch keys and beer. Reporting live from Hamtramck, I'm Priya Mann. Local four. Here. Hamtramck what knows a, how to do it right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Priya. A lot of fun out there.